Cheers, everybody. Welcome to your daily dose of me. That's why right. welcome back to another beer review. And in this one, we've got a Michela sent to me by Matthew Barker. Thank you very much, sir. And it's a sour. And it's a sea buckthorn sour. And we have a bottle of uh, Michela's Scour Scandinavia. Super smashing great, clocking in at 7.7% ABV. Now, C. Buckthorn. I'll, I'll tell you what I know about C. Buckthorn. It says, it says sour ale brewed with C. Buckthorn, and I think it's aged in oak folders, if that's how you pronounce it. 7.7% um, ABV. Um, I think this is actually brewed in Belgium. Not too sure. But it's under Michaela Banner anyway. Um, Seed bark form is, I think it's like a like a weed which has berries, and these berries are quite nutritious. They have certain vitamins in, um, and you can get oil, seed bark form oil as well. Um, this is the first time I've ever come across it, you know, as a you know used in um, beer. So I'm looking forward to this. It's got to be something different. There's the plain crown. Let's see what we get. Hmm. Quite a very herbaceous in the aroma, actually. It's like a a sweet berryness there. And it's kind of like herb, a herbal type of aroma there as well. And then you do get a slight acidicness as well. It smells really nice. It smells intriguing. So let's whack this in and see what it's all about. You know, Michela, a quality, isn't they? Really. <clears throat> There's nothing that Michela don't do which ain't good. I don't know if I said that right. <laughs> Pardon me. Cabin fever, boys and girls. Cabin fever. So I just poured it out. Stick it there. Yeah, it's, it's, heads just disappeared. Um, as you can see, it, it, it does look like a cloudy cider to me, to be honest, but um, there's not much slight haziness to it. Dark browny, well, like a browny, dirty colour. And again, you do get more of an acidicness, tartness in the aroma. It does smell similar to cider to me. Um, then there is a slight herbaceousness there, but not much. And we're going to go in, so cheers, Matthew, mate. Nice soft carbonation is what I feel first. Then you get greeted with... Well, I could imagine what sea buckthorn is. <laughs> Never had it in my life. Um, like a, there is a berry. It's a weird. It's it's like a berry. It tastes like a berry, but it also tastes like a like a herb as well. At the same time. That's why I'm picking up. Um, there is a slight oily texture. It could be my imagination in this beer as well. I'm picking up a slight oily texture. Lovely soft carbonation. Then is when you swallow it, you pick up the real sourness. Creep it up on you. After this tartness, um, it's in, it's an interesting one. I have to say, it's uh, as I'm drinking it, it reminds me. There's some parts of this beer that reminds me of a lambic. There's some parts of this beer what reminds me of a cider. There's some parts of this beer. Which remind me of a Berliner Weiss. But 
it's it's really yeah it's nice it's really it's different it's different for me personally um again again as i'm going in there was that berryness and herbaceousness are quite even on your palate you, you're picking up both at the same time and you're picking up the acidicness starts to come to the fore as well as you go in but it's not bad at all it's very very different um yeah very very different very very different quite refreshing as well it leaves a lovely sense of refreshment in your mouth it makes your mouth feel you know, makes your mouth feel very moist if that makes sense most probably doesn't because you're watching one of my beer reviews boys and girls um get some thumbs up for me this um alcohol 7.7 percent .7%, you're not picking that up in there you're not picking up seven percent in that at all so boys and girls michaela scar scandinavia go out give it a go yourselves <coughs> if you had it before tell me in the comments um please subscribe give me a thumbs up if you subscribe my channel you can ring my bell as well if you want thank you very much for watching this beer review as ever your stars every one of you stay safe and that's the main key and i shall see you all again tomorrow with another beer review so cheers everyone